Hometown Happenings is brought to you by Foothill 7 TV and the Thompson's family of automotive dealerships. The Women's Fund El Dorado is a philanthropic organization that really uh, focuses all of, its, all of its energies on supporting the health and well-being of uh, families within our community. It is a collective giving um, organization versus a service organization. So what that means is that um, members don't have to do fundraising. They don't have to sell raffle tickets. Um, it, it's more a matter of pooling our money together and uh, making, uh, educating ourselves on the needs of the community and then uh, making those grants. In June we have a, a, a grants gala where we award the grants and we also have our previous year's grant recipients come back to tell us what they did with the grant monies. Um, in October we have a dinner that is um, kind of a celebration of what we've done and also a very good opportunity for members to bring guests, people they know who may be interested in joining us well. And in January we have what we call a community needs forum and this is our educational component where um, we have already asked our members what they want to focus on and they've told us so then we bring in some professionals in that area to talk to us about that and the needs in El Dorado County as far as that focus area. Well, we currently have approximately 330 members. We have an endowment fund that has reached the level of $288,000 and we're able to grant about $55,000 a year to various organizations that submit applications towards what our members have determined to be our areas of interest for any given year. The goal of the Lighthouse Fund is to help uh, support needs, medical and dental needs, uh, for various folks within our community who have emergencies that they just can't manage of their own. The goal of the Wickline Scholarship Fund is to support the needs of women who are finding an interest in wanting to go back to school, to um, create a different career for themselves, um, folks who have had hardships that they are beginning to be able to overcome and just need a little bit more help in doing so. People can be involved as little as writing a check for $200 and voting every year and the voting is very easy, it's by email. The Women's Fund is uh, hoping to make a change in El Dorado County. I mean we're already seeing the impact. Um, I think that you know most of us realize that if we wrote a check for $200 and gave it to a group that we wanted to support, they would love to get it, they'd be very happy to receive it. But then when you see the impact of collectively putting those $200 checks together and giving a group a $20,000 grant that makes an impact, I think this is, this is what we want to see happen in El Dorado County, some significant change that we can be proud of and, and do collectively as a group. What we really would like to share with um, folks through this program um, is the idea that we are very pleased and proud of what we have been able to accomplish and yet we really believe we've only just begun to touch the needs within our community and we're looking always for more members, for more ideas, for more individuals who want to come together to help us support the health and well-being of the folks who live within El Dorado County.